Good morning. This demonstration is just to show you how to add information to a PDF. So the first thing you would need to do is open the PDF document, but opening it on a Mac would just take you to preview. On any device, if you open with Adobe Reader, once you're in Adobe Reader, you'll have the features that you need to add text within the, the, the work itself. So you'd have to click up here on the sign and add text. And once you click on that, you'll have the ability to add text by double clicking into sections in the box. So if you wanted to call it day two, or you wanted to enter a specific date, then you could enter the information you needed if that was accurate. Now you should be able to go in and edit the text that you've put into the box. Mm. But there, are, and yes, you can. So you can go in and make adjustments. Uh, once you've finished adding the information, then you would you could save as, and then change the file name. You can save it to an online account, or you can save it directly to your desktop, wherever you'd like to put the work. So you'll notice that once I put information into the sheet itself, if I change the date and call it day two, and then give it a specific scheduled date of the week, then I can save it and it should show up on my computer with the edited changes that I've made. So this is how you would take a PDF and make changes to it. Now if you wanted to put a signed or sign a PDF itself, what you can do is use the Adobe Reader, use the same text feature, and you can place a signature directly into your work. Now you can draw the signature or you can type the signature. This is a typed example of the signature. If you wanted to draw the signature then you would handwrite it directly in here and then click accept and then you can position the signature where you need to on the document. Once that signature has been attached then you can say file save as sign page, put it onto the desktop and then you can attach it to whatever file you would need to. And there's the sign page and the signature is attached. And notice how it can't be removed from the page itself. So that's an example about how to use your Adobe Reader to edit PDFs.